Journalists are used to having doors slammed in our faces, but this weekend, the tables are turned because it's Doors Open Ottawa. More than 100 locations around the city are opened and offering never-before-seen behind-the-scenes glimpses at what happens inside, including here at the Canadian Guide Dogs for the Blind Training Centre in Manitick. Um, we're open between uh, 10 and 4 tomorrow and uh, anyone coming to the facility will be able to see guide dogs uh, demonstrations. Also we have uh, assistance dog demonstrations as well. Um, our kennels will be open uh, to the public and also our residents and facility. Obviously if you love dogs this is the right place to come. There'll be lots of dogs here. Uh, we also have a lovely scented garden um, and uh, I, as I said you will be able to watch the demonstrations of uh, the work that a guide dog does and also an assistance dog. At any given time we have between 30 and 40 dogs in our in our kennel um, but we also have a, a lot of um, pups and dogs out in foster homes. Closer to town there are lots of other cool places you could check out including Earnscliff, the home of the British High Commissioner which is open to the public for the first time since 2009 or the Hydro Ottawa number two generating station on Amelia Island. For the Ottawa Citizen I'm Matthew Pearson.